Hello and well, welcome to this particular course and this is a short introduction video but it will uh, just let you know what exactly the motto of this particular whole training and uh, how you need to go with okay so let me tell you about myself it should be a short brief but still uh, I have 14 years of IT experience and primary focus was on uh, Windows domain and I also worked on VMware Veritas products and it also have some uh, various cluster servers with net backup and also do some data migration work okay i am also been in a part of corporate training and i do give freelance corporate training for uh, i've already given to accenture hcl cognigen and many more it leading companies and i i have a site which is called ai caddy support on that if you want a live training session you can go there and also get a live training session from there you can book it from there as well okay uh, this course uh, to get an IT job I've seen people there are so many uh, type of uh, engineers who are trying to um, uh, come into this particular IT job or there are certain people who are there in the desktop profile and they want to migrate themselves or transition themselves to a Windows Server profile so this is an ideal course for them and this is covering right and practical things which you really need to learn before you go to uh, to crack an uh, interview or a job so I would say uh, these are very important points which you need to uh, keep focus on okay do not um, afraid of getting an internship or a low paid position initially if you are a newbie uh, you should grab opportunity whatever the opportunity you are getting right do not hesitate on that so experience is more worthy rather getting a low paid salary okay just keep in mind experience is really more worthy than getting a less paid or low paid job it will help you to grab better uh, what you can say better job in the future better salary right because when you are getting some um, hands-on experience then you will learn uh, new things and new way of troubleshooting the things so when you have experience then you can also explain yourself and your skills better and that will help you to get better job with a better salary and just just a matter of thinking right any type of uh, experience to count and uh, let's say we, we are trying to teach you about the windows profile and how the windows server 2012 works what are the things are there in windows server 2012 and all the things that i want to share in this particular training that is totally what you can say totally a uh, practical sort of thing right and that experience you can also put into your resume and you can also explain that these are the things which you have done okay but you need to build your own lab as well to go with this particular training get the most out of this particular course this is this is very important right just follow me step by step and whatever the task I'm doing try to understand first and then really go ahead and build your lab and follow the same method and do a hell lot of practice okay write down everything whatever you have learned from this particular course in your resume okay organize the experience which you have gained from this particular course and you just need to format your resume which should be very crisp and able to understand what exactly you do and what exactly the skill set you have so practically uh, if we are um, talking about if, if you want to really uh, talk about the practical work which we are uh, which we are going to do in this particular training so you need to d define them as a bullet point okay in the interview you should go line by line and explain them and also uh, talk about a little bit of scenario when you try to build a domain controller or you try to apply a group policy uh, there can be a possibility you will get some mm, hurdles right how you fix them and if you do some um, active uh, enabling user IDs or disabling them whatever the things you are um, doing or in, in the practical scenario you should have the capability to explain those things okay so also once your resume has been drafted I would recommend you to send the, your resume to your friends just to take a review and what they say about your resume and thanks again uh, for this particular uh, purchasing this particular course and you will be getting lots of things to learn and I will be happy to make you understand the things which I have already mentioned in this particular training if you have anything in your mind just shoot a query to me I will happy to answer and help you guide further see you in the next video